What if I told you some of nature's best problem solvers don't even have a brain? When we think of intelligence, we imagine neurons, brains, maybe even artificial intelligence. But nature's been solving complex problems long before brains existed. Take fungi and slime molds. They're not just weird, they're brilliant. This is Fissurum polycephalum, a slime mold. It has no nervous system, yet when placed in a maze with food at the end, it explores every possible path and then retracts all the inefficient ones, leaving behind the shortest route. It literally optimizes its own shape, solving what computer scientists call the shortest path problem. And it does it using nothing but chemical signals and feedback loops. In one famous experiment, it even recreated the Tokyo subway system better than the engineers did. Now, meet the mycelium, fungal threads that connect trees across entire forests. This underground network transfers water, nutrients, and even warning signals between plants. But here's the genius part. When a tree dies or a root is cut off, the fungus reroutes the flow. Just like an internet network finding a new path when a cable goes down, it manages resources, responds to stress, and keeps the whole ecosystem stable. Researchers now study these behaviors to design better communication systems, disaster response networks, and decentralized infrastructure. Brains aren't the only way to solve problems. By using distributed systems, chemical gradients, and simple feedback, fungi and molds handle complexity elegantly, without thinking at all. So next time you hit a traffic jam or your GPS goes wild, just remember, Somewhere underground, a brainless fungus is quietly doing it better. If nature can solve problems without a brain, imagine what you can do with one. Subscribe for more genius insights from the weirdest corners of science and check the comments for links to mind-expanding ideas.